says David encouraged himself in the Lord his God. You have to do the same. You will resolve. David has never recovered all what he lost, but he encouraged himself. The day you stop weeping, Satan will no longer bring with In verse 6, the Bible says David encouraged himself in the Lord his God. Encourage yourself in that prevailing circumstance in your life. Because in that situation, there is going to be a miracle. I want to illustrate the work of the potter in the life of a person. Because I don't have enough time to do a deeper exposition of that passage. In John chapter 9 that we read. Hello. Touch the one by you on his shoulders. Look at him eyeball to eyeball. Keep on looking at him. 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 him. You have brought victory into your life. Hallelujah. 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 Amen. Can we just rise up for one minute? Stand up for one minute. Except the, 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 the elderly and all our royal fathers. Keep on standing for one minute. I'm not punishing you. Because even myself, God is not punishing me. So I just do only. We are just standing together. Hello. I said, I want to give us an example. In John chapter 9, verse 1 to 11, that we read, there was a man there. He was born blind right from his mother's womb. Can we really say that the potter did well in his life? Because some of us, when we started to grow up and we discover the situation we find ourselves, we don't feel very comfortable with them. The people around started to say, well, for this man to be born blind, something must be wrong. Is either the mother or the father committed sin. They kept on saying it until they got to Jesus. Whatsoever people might be saying concerning you, no, whatsoever they can say about your situation, what the potter is saying and what he has said is the most important. The potter is telling me that he's speaking prosperity into your life this day. Say, who actually committed sin? Is it this man or the parent that he was born blind? Jesus now silenced them. See, concerning this man, keep short. Friend, friend, mind your own business. Mind your business. Don't put your trouble in, yourself into trouble because of another yes, problem. Jesus said, Hey, 
Jesus said, this man did not commit any sin. Neither the parents. That he met himself in this situation. The one you are mocking is better than you before God. Don't allow sin to be compounded. You just receive grace. It is not because you are smart. I used to tell people in the office we must be careful the way we portray ourselves. There are so many qualified Baptist ministers that the Lord did not appoint. That we should stop just bragging and hello uh, <laughs> it's only that the yam is serving leaves that we are respecting it <laughs> hallelujah 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 jesu ni ki ogbo olorun o le ba han ninu aye okunrin in la fi bi la foju jesus said this man was born blind so that the glory of God must be re- I might be reflected in him. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Let me tell you. Sorry, but that was a, a situation that you are angry about. It is because the glory of the creator will pass through. The, the creative glory of God will go through. The creative glory, the creative glory will go through. And when that happens, you yourself won't be the same thing again. The glory of the Lord will be revealed in your life. The glory of God will be revealed in your life. Tell the one standing by you and look at him, I bought you. Say, Father, Mama, Friend, Kabiesi, the, the glory of the Creator will Cut through your life. The glory of the Creator will pass through your life. And when that happens, the glory of the Lord will be revealed in your life. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Beat your chest and say, For what buyer? For what Lura Elijah? The situation passing through. Oh, Timon La Koja. We never weigh me down. Kone Mumira was because Nitori Pe the potter knows am, about it. I'm a cocoma nepai. It is to the glory of God. Four Gualoni. It is to the glory of God. Four Gualoni. The glory of God. Oh, Gualoni. We so far. Your turn, Jade. In my life. Then why ye me? The entire world we see it. In the mighty name of Jesus. Jesus. Amen. Amen. Sit down for one minute. After Jesus has said that, what? Was Jesus' action? He did an amazing thing that all those who have been mocking this man will not be able to talk again. After you have confessed that the glory of God will show in your life, God is starting the process of that glory now. In the mighty name of Jesus. 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 Jesus has spat on the ground. I could see about three principal things that happened. Number one. Was the miracle of recreation. By the touch 
of the potter. Lati pa se owo amokoko. The second one. Owo ikeji. Was the miracle of refixing. Owo ni ise iya nu atunse by the touch of the potter. Nipa ifowo kan amokoko. The the third the third thing. Owo iketa was the miracle of renewal. Owo ni ise iya nu isodo tun by the touch of the potter. Lati pa se amokoko. Bo ni o se si se atunda. How did they go about the work of recreation? The two eyes became were blind. It has never opened for once. Because the clay originally is already hardened. Jesus now spat. He spoke to the earth. He spat on the ground. He said, he to the, this, this, the spitting he was doing, he was talking to the creation of this man. This morning, he said, your creation, the Lord will speak to it. The Lord will speak to it. He molded the clay and he used the clay to touch the man's eyes. In this refixing is the anointing. He made spitu from the clay. Remolded the clay and anointed the eyes of the man with the clay. Yes. He anointed the eyes with the clay. The point at which you need a new creation, a recreation, that the Lord will have to refix, straighten up, and then make straight the way it's supposed to be. This morning, the power of God will locate it. And he will refix the exact place. He will refix the exact place. He will refix the exact place. Thirdly, the Lord said he should go and wash at the pool of Sloan. And the Bible said he went. And he, 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 he bathed there. And when he was coming back, nobody was uh, leading him. He saw. He went as a blind person. He returned as a sighted person. Because the potter has finished work on his life. The potter is doing the work in the life of men, in the life of women, in the life of children, in the life of the elderly ones. He is now taking you to the point of renewal. Is taking you to the point of renewal. Such that when you are cleansed by the power of the blood, you are filled with the spirit of the Lord and the glory and power of God comes upon you, you will go back oh, gloriously. You will release yourself into faith that will make you to go home gloriously. Rise up on your feet. Rise up on your feet. 
Uh, whoever wants to sit down, let him continue the now. The moment we are now is a moment of recreation. A moment of refixion. And a moment of renewal. And you will go back a brand new individual. Oh, Father Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. The situation of Nigeria is still under control. Until nineteen fourteen, there was no nation Nigeria. And Nigeria will continue to be in the presence of the Lord. Nigeria Osimawa, ne wajulua. Nigeria 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 